Previously on Aftermath. Kids, meet Grandpa. I witnessed them murder some people. Your father ordered my death. Drag me somewhere. She didn't do anything. <laughs> that means safe shifter. Get away from my family! <laughs> Who's this witch? Take this. It's Tetra. You might need it. Gosh. Has anyone noticed the moon today? My people around the steeple of the Temple of the Dog. It's got me running, flying, Santa and Praying that those brand new daytime stars are what they seem, and not some nightmare dream of death. Hey, don't. Do you know where the extra water jug is? No, don't do that. Hey, Dad. Yeah. We're out of water. No, I don't know. Has vast amounts of water. I'm sure we'll find some. <clears throat> How you feeling, Dad? Never better. Oh my God! All right, pop quiz. Fun facts about Idaho. I grew up here. It has more ghost towns than anywhere else in the country. That is correct. There is no country anymore. That is incorrect, Matt. <laughs> Jeez, since what are you the buzz killer? I thought that was Dana. Yeah, that was really out of character, Matt. Maybe I'm a shapeshifter. You are not. I know for sure. Dana wouldn't. What are you talking about? I saved you. You were aiming at me, not her, Dana. You missed. Oh, Bree, come on. Not cool. You know, I saw a wild blueberry bush over here. Anybody want to come help me pick them? Go Maybe on. later? Hey, hey! I guess we'll do it. Hey, look. Why are stars out in the daytime? Those aren't stars. I've been watching. They've changed position. They're visible in the daylight, which means they're hundreds of miles across and possibly on fire. Asteroids. If they'd be millions of miles off course, though. And that'd be bad. Yeah, Matt, when is it not bad? <sighs> yeah. But these ones won't hit us. They're actually kind of pretty. Right, Mom? Yeah, they were pretty. these people. They look stretched. His eyes are a different color. The hell is this? I don't know. He's like 10 feet long. Why is he uh, stretched? There's only three bodies here. Where's the little boy? One forty two. Sharp for fever heads and GRs. No one gets between us and the Tetra. If there's any left, just go. Watch your step, Dad. I'm sure I'm fine. We don't need to stop. Like hell, we don't. Spread out, safety's off. Stay focused. I don't need Tetra. You need it, and you need it soon. Dad, be careful. Let's move, guys. Hey, what? What's this? There's nothing. There's no more Tetris stacks? What's Sugamadex? Sugamadex. It reverses neuromuscular blockade. Awesome. And completely useless. Tetra, Dana. We need Tetra. This disease is weeks old. Nobody knows where it started or, or how it spreads. Just because one antibiotic works doesn't mean others won't. Great. And while you conduct your drug trials, we lose our dad. Screw you, Dana.
So, you, uh, want to talk? What Dana said in the bar, she was drunk. No, she wasn't, Matt. Okay, fine. But you always win these things. We're all afraid of what's gonna happen to Dad, but you can't take it out on Dana. I'm not, okay? You realize we haven't seen a single person in this town? Kinda reminds me that you're no beloved in front of us all four. How can you be thinking about video games right now? Please. Oh my god, you're such a dude. You loved FA4 as much as I did. Probably more. I mean, you and Dana always kicked my ass. You were so overconfident. I mean, come on, there's no way in hell you're winning a two against one death match. Like, no way. Oh, I can win two against one. No, you couldn't. There's just the two of you. You guys got good instincts. I mean, both of you, but... You especially. Yeah, well... You were super overconfident. <laughs> you would have kept kicking your ass, too, yeah. if Dad didn't make a stop. He's so stupid. Too violent, Too guys. <laughs> So do you think what happened in Seattle happened here then? I don't know. Okay, well, New York's gone. LA's gone. Not everybody we meet dies, and we're still standing here. Why is that? Never thought about it. I'm gonna go check on Dad. You stay here with the stacks, look for some Tetra. I bet if anybody finds it, it's you. All right. He's gone! Oh, shit! He could be anywhere by now. Everything dies. No. Dad! 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 Hey! Guys, over here! Looking for the Tetra. Honey. Okay, guys, Can I have your gun? Please. We have to face it, Josh. I know it's the plague. Yes. We're just, we're just being careful for the kids. Yeah, of course. We'll find some Tetra, make everything okay. We're gonna find it. Yep. I'm sorry I didn't get my dad's. Karen. The odds are that it was poisoned. Yeah, he said it wasn't. Well, he... Also, your father ordered my execution. You could be trusted, so... Thank you. Mom! Yeah? I found something. Let's get your dad to the RV. Okay, what is it? It's a tetra, it's a tetra box. A tetra box. It's empty. But look at the address. Coastal Cross long-term care, uh-huh. So? Yeah, it's a few blocks away. We passed it, but... If they took regular deliveries... They may still have some there. Exactly. Here it is. Coastal Cross Long-Term Care Facility. Girls, you're with me. We're gonna go room by room. What about me? Stay with your father. Keep an eye on him. It could take us hours. We don't know when he's gonna become a danger to himself. All right. Stay with him no matter what, but not up here. You're too open. Go down the hill, go someplace private. We'll meet you there when we're done. Let's go. Honey, I'm doing this to keep you safe. I love you.
I'll stand watch you guys look in there. I got nothing. Me neither. Shit. There should be a dispensary on each floor. Let's go. I can talk now. I, I got, if they don't find any tetra, I don't want to hear this. Just remember, there's no man. man this isn't. Look, if I just need you to take the tomato train to the Ario ski wagon. That is, wait, no, 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 no. I want to. I want to. I want to. Wait, wait. What's his name? His name. Hey, what now? We search every floor, don't stop until we find Tetra. Do you hear that? Don't even think about it. This is an automatic. Drop the guns or get stitched. Do it. You marauders, why are you here? Marauders? Uh, GRs? GRs? No, we're not GRs. I'm Karen Farrell. These are my daughters. Uh, my husband needs tetracycline. That's why we're here. GRs? Uh, GRs. Gone rogue. Uh, people who don't follow the law. Gone rogue. Oh, I get it now. That's clever. <laughs> I'm sorry you had to witness that. But after what happened, I shoot on sight now. It's an open carry state, thank God. Glad I hesitated on you. Me too. Do you live here? Yeah, I've been a caregiver here for 10 years. After the earthquakes, there were rumors some final event, a meteor headed straight for town, big enough to blow up Idaho or the world, even so everybody took off. Not me. My patients needed me. So my family and I took refuge here. Nothing hit, but nobody ever came back either. Just those darn marauders. Oh, they raided you? Two weeks ago, they cleaned us out of meds, including Tetra. My husband, Eddie, tried to stop them. My daughter and I hid in a closet, but one of those men must have had the plague because after she... Well, she's gone now. She's a beautiful young girl, same age as yours. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry I have to ask this, but if your daughter had the plague, do you... Oh, no, I didn't get infected. No, see for yourself. Yeah, she's clear. Yeah. Thank you. Yep. My husband has the plague. I turned down tetracycline that could have saved his life if he dies. It's my fault. Can you help? <laughs> I remember his name. His name was Josh Copeland. It's one of one, four, two. One, four, two. Did you get it? It was the man in the, in the berries, the man that died, his man watch. In the berries from this morning. His watch was at one, four, okay. two. His, his watch said one, four, two. One, four, two. One, four, two. One, four, two. Just like Seattle. Like Seattle, Seattle, man. The news footage? Seattle! I've already seen it. Check it, check it, check Seattle! Okay. Just... Seattle happened at 142. The stretched out people came from Seattle. Grandpa. Why'd you turn down the Tetra? It came from my father. He's a very bad man. He runs poison to Tetra. I was stupid not to take it. You know, I... I have some Tetra. You do. And I'd be happy to share, but I want something in return. No, 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 it's nothing bad. I just have wheelchair patients on the top floor. And getting up and down this place is a real drag since the generator went kaput. I just need help getting them down. 
Sure, whatever you need. Great. And you're gonna have to leave your guns downstairs. Strangers with guns really spook the patients. You can grab when you go. This way. Their washes stopped at 142. That means they were, they were part of the Seattle disappearance and they ended up here. Yeah. So you think Grandpa. No. No, no, no. Rona's dog. Rona? Rona's. Grandpa's dog. Rona's eyes. Wait. When Dana got bit by Rona, she said that Rona's eyes were different colors, like the bodies this morning. Mm -hmm. Rona made it. You think Grandpa made it? My pocket. Take my pocket. Okay, the, the four people in the picture, but we only found three bodies. No, four. The sun, the sun. We never found the sun. Not four. You think that if we find the sun, we'll find Grandpa? It's over early in the morning. Uh, Dad, I don't understand what you're saying. It's over in the morning. Bye. Mr. Murkin, you know what? I think we need to just stop for a bit, okay? We need to give you a break, okay? Okay. Sit down. You'll be able to talk more if you take a break for a bit. Let's go for a drive. I can't sit here and watch this happen. The meds are on the second floor in the supply closet. You can't miss it. I'd like to keep going straight up. Can your girls get the Tetra? I'll meet you downstairs. I won't be long. Good. Second floor supply closet. This doesn't look like a supply closet. I'm checking everywhere. Anything? No, nothing. Come on. Dana, this is a bad idea. We shouldn't have split up. Hey, we have to keep going. Okay, it's for Dad. In here. In here, check it. Back at the warehouse. Our last search got cut short. Karen? No, they said they need a few hours. We'll be back in time. Just don't think. I'm not gonna sit here and watch you become a feverhead. Yeah. I'm going in. So you say you turned down Tetra? Or my own father? Your father? Yeah, you don't want to know. Just this way. Mrs. Adelstein. What the dickens are you doing out here, Mrs. Adelstein? What's the matter? Do you need to make boo-boo, Mrs. Adelstein? Hmm? Oh. The elevator works. Hmm? I thought your generator was broken. Sorry, I didn't hear you. You have a generator running no. here? She has Tetra, it's gotta be here. So you don't think that nurse is a little off? Well, define off. Hey, 
I'm only off. If you went through what she did, you'd be off too. Tetra. She probably meant a different supply room. No, I don't think so. Okay, let's keep looking. Okay. She did say the second floor, right? Definitely. Come on. It's locked. Shit. These are my friends, Karen. I stuffed them when they died. I hate change. Harold, how about some chamomile with milk? You'd love that. Uh, uh, and you, Karen, some tea? Oh, you pardon me. Oh, just a sedative. Uh, my girls are waiting for me. And they'll get help when I don't show up. Well, actually, your daughters are locked in on the second floor. See, in places like this, the patients try to leave, so we have electronic door locks. It's for their own good. Ask a statistician and he will tell you. Correlation and causation. So avoid conflation and take dictation, because today begins the end of it all, the final event that's sweeping the nation. Hold your souls together, cats and kittens, and take a panoramic view of this thing that you've been waiting for. Negative Nelly. No. Bob Black, he's always right. <sighs> you guys are listening. My husband knows. He just needs Tetra and he'll help us. He has special knowledge. What are your daughter's dress sizes? Oh. You see, when you stuff people, it's all about the clothes. Mm -hmm. Your wardrobe will be easy to fix. But your girls? Mm -hmm. I'm not so sure. Mm -hmm. Daniel, look out! Did you really expect that to work? The windows in this place are reinforced. We're not getting out through any of them. Shit! Calm down. Brand mom's gonna come for us. Then where is she, Dana? Do you realize if we don't get out of here, dad is done? That's a laundry cart. Where'd you get that? Down the hallway. Come on, Dana! Laundry chute. Locked. Hydrofluoric acid in the supply room. Damn. Why are you doing this? Isn't it gorgeous? Continents drift apart and empires fall, but the moon is always with us. No matter how much gosh darn malarkey is happening in the world, the moon is always there. It's still there, kind of like your best friend. Stop it, Mrs. Adelstein. Stop it! Mrs. Adelstein, I will have to send you downstairs if you are not quiet! Sorry, but I warned you! I feel about that.
Thanks. Are you sure this is a thing? What, science? Yeah, it's a thing. Cover your nose. Hey. As for you. You are always something useful to contribute, huh? Is the acid working? What are you doing? Move. Step back. OK, OK. All right, just so we're clear, that was 90% science, 10% brute force. Force one. It's big enough for one of us to go down. Bree, it has to be you. You have to go. You know I'm claustrophobic. Yeah, that's convenient. No, help me with these sheets. Daughter's God, I don't care what you do to me. Oh, that's nice. What are you going to do to me? There we go. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing? You want mercy from me? After what your father's thugs did to my family? You know, uh, after those men killed my Eddie, I heard one of them say he hadn't met the boss. They said, oh, well, you gotta meet Ewan. He's gonna make us rich on this tetra cook. Sound familiar? Those men came to steal on your father's orders. We're on the same side. Oh, nice try. That you and your girls are just like him. You're, uh, what'd you call it? Uh, GRs? You're wrong. Uh, Am I? Uh, you came uh, with guns to take what doesn't belong to you, just like your father's gangs. Uh, you and Farrell killed my family. Who have you killed? I'm sorry. You wanna know what I'm doing? I'm making things right. It's a paralyzing agent, in case you were wondering. You won't be able to move it to feel every cut until you die. And so will your girls. Kill you! Kill me! 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 Kill me!
that! It's me! Hi! Dad, stop! Stop! There is a stuffed raccoon on a tricycle out here. It gets worse in here. Look at these. God. There's bad shit at work. Dana's mom is up there with this psycho. We have to get her out. Hey, listen to me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, let's go. Of course you are, but maybe back off on the potty mouth. Uh, okay, that's enough. basement power off. Why? Because we might need it later. Stay calm, Catherine. <sighs> okay. Okay, what do you think? Generator, maybe? Or a solar flare? Oh. <sighs> or maybe your girls found a way out after all the trouble I went to. <sighs> well, I guess I'm going to go have to take a look. You sit take care. Oh, look at you. What am I saying? <laughs> Things are starting to get interesting, aren't they? Good. Is she dead? She could be. That was 220. She's out cold. Good. Let's go find Mom. Okay, which way? Who should I know? Okay, cover my six. Really? What all this all for, Dana? Come on, tactics. 
and you say I'm the nerd. Where'd you get your gun from anyways? Tactics, Bree? Come on. Shut up. Oh my god, Mom! Mom! Grace. Dana. Is she... She's just paralyzed. Permanently? Um... No, this will this will wear off after a while. Dana, you know, we can't wait. We gotta get out of here right now. Okay, who's stronger? Yeah, funny, Bree. Just lift her. Come on. How are we getting her down? Um, okay, new plan. I'll, I'll figure out something. You have to go downstairs, turn the power back on. The elevator. Yeah. Right. Bree? Watch for her. I see her, I kill her. It's okay, Mom, I got you. I promise. She gave you a drug, Mom. It paralyzed you, but it's wearing off. There you go. Okay. All right, we'll get you out on the elevator. That's all right. We'll circle around. Come on, come on. Yeah. Come on, we got this. Mm-hmm. Come on, come on. Okay, the elevator is just through that door. Need to be ready, okay? Ignore those guys, they're stuffed. Okay. Mom? Mm-hmm. You've got this, okay? Mom, you've got this. Mom, what is it? if not resilient. Mm-hmm. God damn right. <laughs> hey, psycho! Father. I missed you. <laughs> we have absolutely nothing that can help him, is that right? Careful. Guys, guys, I can walk, I can walk, it's all right. Sure. Yeah, come on. Okay, come on, be careful, be careful. All right, all right. What happened? 
Rode in with a fever head. Out. Thought she was rational. She wasn't. Rational? Does she have Tetra? We found her stash. Just antibiotics and ulcer pills. How's your father? I'm going there. How's your father? Mom. No, don't go in there. Mom, look. It's huge. Oh, yeah, I saw that happen. Oh, my God. As long as the moon stays up there. No, not the moon, Mom. The debris. What about it? Those rocks look small from here, but they're headed to Earth. And when they hit... I don't think I want to know this. I don't either. What? You have to know. Dinosaur extinction times 10 or 20. I don't believe you. How do you know those rocks won't just go back into space? Some of them will. Some of them will just settle into a debris field around the moon. But the rest will hit us. Big shit pulls little shit towards itself. That's how it works. How long? Depends on velocity. A couple of days, maybe. Well, I don't know about that, but I do know your father doesn't have a couple of days. That's what we're going to focus on. He's our first and only priority, our number one focus. I'm not going to give up on your father. <laughs> Many. Let them die. <laughs>